You've probably heard people starting to talk about big data, cloud computing, and the Internet of Things, IoT. You haven't? Where have you been? Didn't you know that by 2020, up to 50 billion devices will be connected to the Internet? No? I know you think this is all hype and it's going to pass you by. Why would you want to connect your lights to the Internet and get them to talk to a computer? Let's look at the building you have today. It's packed full of systems like fire alarms, CCTV, security alarms, data networks, lighting, HVAC, telephones. The building is groaning under the weight of all of the separate cables and sensors, and keeping them all working is time-consuming. What you would really like is all of these separate systems to talk to each other, so you can sit at your desk and keep a watchful eye over things and spot trouble before your clients complain. Good luck with that one. That's one expensive mission. Or is it? This is what IoT is really about everyday devices talking to each other over the internet. Think about it. Why do you need a sensor for the security alarm and a separate sensor to turn the lights off? Why won't the lighting system also switch the heating off? Wouldn't it be great if all these systems could share data? But that's only half the story. IoT is going to enable a whole new world of solutions to help the people in your workplace be more effective at doing their jobs. Now you're really confused. You think I'm mad? All you really care about is lights? Trust me, someday soon, your boss is going to come through the door and ask what this IoT is all about. Hmm, unless he goes to the IT guy first. Yes, the same guy who blocked you from using YouTube for years. Do you really want the IT guy to be in charge of this initiative? If I was you, I'd go along to Lux Live this November, take a tour around the IoT experience, and talk to the people who can make this happen. Revolutionize your lighting and your business. Register today at luxlive.co.uk.